emergencies in renal failure and dialysis patients. Outline Functions of the kidneys Types of renal failure Causes of acute renal failure Causes of chronic kidney disease Emergencies in renal failure Hyperkalemia at 29.0 second Treatment of hyperkalemia Treat if ECG changes Neuromuscular sign K plus greater than 6.0 Urgent indications for dialysis in renal failure Principles of hemodialysis Vascular access hemodialysis Problems with vascular access, management. Emergencies during hemodialysis. Hypotension, causes, management. Hypotension on hemodialysis. Muscle cramps. Arrhythmias. Ear embolism. Dialyzer reactions, type A. B. Dialysis disequilibrium. Hemolysis. Intracranial bleeding. Hypoglycemia. Mechanics of peritoneal dialysis. Steps of CAPD exchange with. Functions of the kidneys. Production of urine. Removal of waste products, example urea, creatinine, uric acid, etc. Maintenance of acid base balance, maintenance of electrolyte balance, vitamin D and calcium metabolism, maintenance of HB and bleeding parameters, excretion of drugs and toxins, maintenance or control of BP. Types of renal failure A. Acute renal failure ARF Decline of renal function rapidly over days to weeks, up to 3 months Rise in serum creatinine of 0.5 to 1.5 mg per deciliter per day Reversible B. Chronic renal failure CRF Decline of renal function over months to years. Irreversible. C. Acute on chronic renal failure. Dehydration. Drugs. Infection. Obstruction, etc. Causes of acute renal failure. A. Pre-renal. Dehydration. Blood loss burns, cardiac failure, etc. b. Renal Glomerular Glomerulonephritis Vascular Renal artery stenosis Atherombolic Vasculitis Renal vein thrombosis Tubulointerstitial NSAIDS Brufin, Vovron, etc. Urinary infections. Drugs. Amikacin, Gentamicin. Note. Sepsis causes both A and B. C. Post renal. Renal stones. Ureteric stones. Bladder stones. Urethral, ureteral strictures. Enlarged prostate. Causes of chronic kidney disease. Diabetes. Hypertension. Stones. Recurrent infections. Congenital. Unknown. Effects of renal failure. Hyperpara. Thyroidism. Pulmonary edema, hydrotension, 
hepatitis HIV infection. Amenorrhea at 5.45 minute. Pruritus. Uremic encephalopathy. Cerebro. Vascular accidents. Dialysis dementia. Aluminium. Pericarditis. Coronary atherosclerosis. Cardiomyopathy. Arrhythmia. GI bleeding. Constipation. Pancreatitis. Lipid disorder anemia. Renal osteodystrophy. Muscular cramps. Peripheral neuropathy. Peripheral vascular. Emergencies in renal failure. Cardiovascular. MI. Arrhythmias. Pericarditis. Hypertension. Pulmonary. Pulmonary edema. Infections. Gastro. Intestinal bleeding. Neurologic. Encephalopathy. Strokes. Hematological. Anemia. Infections. Electrolyte disturbances. Potassium. Calcium. Magnesium. Metabolic acidosis. Hyperkalemia. ECG changes. Peaking of T waves. V2, 3. Decrease in P wave amplitude. Widening of QRS complex. PR prolongation. Left axis deviation. L, B, B, B. Sine wave pattern. Cardiac arrest. ECG changes of hyperkalemia. Serum potassium. Milli equivalent per liter. Hyperkalemia. 10 ventricular fibrillation. 9 auricular standstill. Intraventricular block. 8 prolonged PR interval, high T wave, depressed ST segment, 7 high T wave, 5 normal. Treatment of hyperkalemia. Treat if ECG changes, neuromuscular signs, K plus greater than 6.0. Drug onset, duration, mechanism. Calcium gluconate 10%. Immediate 30 to 60 minutes. Cardioprotective. Sodium bicarbonate 5 to 10 minutes. 1 to 2 hours. Intracellular shift of pot. Glucose insulin 2 to 4 hours. 20 to 60 minutes. Intracellular shift. Salbutamol nebulizer, 2 to 3 hours, 30 to 60 minutes. Intracellular shift. Diuretic, Lasix. Potassium exchange resin in mannitol, oral or enema, 1 to 4 hours, few hours. Removal. Hemodialysis, 2 to 3 hours. Several hours removal. Low potassium diet. Avoid hypercalmic drugs. Urgent indication for dialysis in renal failure. Hyperkalemia. Fluid overload. Pericarditis. Acidosis. Encephalopathy. Bleeding diathesis. Principles of hemodialysis Blood is passed on one side of a semi-permeable membrane. Dialysate fluid is passed on the other side of the semi-permeable membrane. Exchange of solutes and water takes place across the semi-permeable membrane. Exchange takes place 
via diffusion and convection, ultrafiltration. Dialysis fluid compartment. Blood. Blood compartment. Water products. Water electrolytes. Semi permeable membrane. Dialysis fluid. Rate of diffusion depends on size of the solute, permeability of the membrane. Concentration gradient. In ultrafiltration, mainly water is transported across the membrane via convection. Solutes are dragged along. Solvent drag. The hemodialysis blood circuit. Dialyser. Dialysis fluid. Blood. Heparin pump. Blood pump. Clamp, arterial pressure monitor, arterial access from patient, venous pressure monitor, air detector, bubble trap, clamp, venous access to patient, vascular access for hemodialysis. Single lumen venous catheters, femoral jugular subclavian, double lumen venous catheters, atrio venous fistula, semino brescia AVF, atrio venous graft, synthetic or natural. Primary arteriovenous radiocephalic fistula, cephalic vein, radial artery, arteriovenous polytetrafluoroethylene grafts in the arm, brachial artery, cephalic vein, PTFE graft. Problems with vascular access management A. Jugular or subclavian catheters, arterial puncture, withdraw needle, apply pressure for 10 minutes, hematoma, pressure, ice pack, antibiotics, pneumothorax, oxygen, intercoastal chest tube, thrombosis, heparin, anticoagulants, thrombectomy. Infection, remove catheter, culture tip, antibiotics. B. Femoral catheters, arterial puncture, withdraw needle, apply pressure for 10 minutes. Hematoma, pressure, ice pack, antibiotics. Thrombosis, heparin, anticoagulants. Thrombectomy. Infection. Remove catheter, culture tip, antibiotics. Rupture. Pressure ligation. Aneurysm. Clipping. Thrombosis. Heparin. Anticoagulants. Thrombectomy. Infection. Antibiotics. Emergencies during hemodialysis, hypotension, muscle cramps, arrhythmias, air embolism, dialyzer reactions, dialysis disequilibrium, hemolysis, intracranial bleeding, hypoglycemia, hypotension causes. Management. Number 1. Excessive decrease in blood volume. Control ultrafiltration rate and volume. Infuse fluids. Number 2. Impaired vasoconstriction due to acetate containing dialysate. Use bicarb dialysate. Warm dialysate. Cool dialysate but not too much. 
Food ingestion. Avoid food during dialysis. Autonomic neuropathy. Mydodrine. Antihypertensive drugs. Give after dialysis. Cardiac diseases. Cardiomyopathy. Digoxin. Ischemic heart disease. Sorbitrate. Tissue ischemia. Improve HP. Cardiac tamponade. Pericardiosynthesis. Hemorrhage. Blood transfusion. Septicemia. Antibiotics. Hypotension on hemodialysis. General management. Put patient in Trendelenburg position. Give a bolus of 100 ml of 0.9% saline. Make the ultrafiltration rate 0. As a last resort, slow the blood flow rate. Muscle cramps. Etiology. Hypotension. Patient below dry weight. Low sodium dialysis solution. Management. Hypertonic saline or dextrose. Prevention. High sodium dialysis solution. Vitamin E. Quinine. Cottonine. Oxazepam. Arrhythmias. Etiology. Digitalis. Ischemic heart disease. Electrolyte disturbances. K. C. A. M. G. P. O. 4. Pericarditis. Calcific cardiomyopathy. Management. Anti arrhythmic drugs. Adenosin, verapamil, bretilium, etc. Air embolism. Etiology. Dialyzer. Dialysis fluid. Blood. Heparin pump. Blood pump. Clamp. Arterial pressure monitor. Arterial access from patient. Venous pressure monitor. Air detector. Bubble trap. Clamp. Venous access to patient. Manifestations. Dyspnea. Cough. Chest pain. LOC. Convulsions. Foam in venous blood line of dialyzer. Churning sound on cardiac auscultation. Management. Clamp the venous line. Left lateral. 100% O2. Try aspiration of air from ventricle. Dialyzer reactions. Type A or B. Type A. Anaphylactic. Type B. Non-specific. First 5 minutes of dialysis. First 60 minutes of dialysis. Dyspnea, burning, angioedema, urticaria, hypotension, etc. Back pain, chest pain, moderate or severe, mild. Due to ACE, 1. Acetate, bradykinin, contaminated dialysate, ETO, Heparin, glove allergy, complement activation. Treatment, stop dialysis immediately. Adrenaline, avil, steroids. Continue dialysis, no specific treatment. Prevention, rinse dialyser well, plus correct primary cause.
Dialyzer reuse. Dialysis disequilibrium. Manifestations. Vomiting, headache, restlessness, seizures, coma. Etiology. Rapid acute reduction in urea. Management. Mild. Symptomatic. Reduce blood flow. Hypertonic solutions. Severe. Stop dialysis. Anti-epileptics. Manitol. Prevention. Gradually increase dialysis duration from 1 hour per session to 4 hours per session. Hemolysis. Manifestations. Dyspnea. Cough. Chest pain. LOC. Convulsions. Form in venous bloodline of dialyzer. Churning sound on cardiac auscultation. Management. Clamp the venous line. Left lateral. 100% O2. Try aspiration of air from ventricle. Intracranial bleeding. Hypoglycemia. Manifestations. Seizures. Strokes, coma, etiology, heparin, hypertension, treatment, administer protamin, neurologic management, hypoglycemia, manifestations, sweating, weakness, tachycardia, etc. Etiology, insulin, anorexia, Dialysis Management IV 25% dextrose Prevention Avoid insulin before dialysis Mechanics of peritoneal dialysis Peritoneal membrane acts as a semi-permeable membrane. Inflow is by gravity and takes about 10 to 20 minutes. Outflow is again by gravity and takes about 20 to 30 minutes. Dwell time is from the end of inflow to the beginning of outflow. Time is variable 10 minutes to 4 hours. Commonly used peritoneal access device is a swan neck 10 cough PD catheter which is placed surgically. Dialysate fluid consists of dextrose 1.5%, 2.5%, sodium chloride, calcium, magnesium in 2 liters of water, potassium, heparin, insulin and antibiotics can be added if needed. Common types of peritoneal dialysis catheter Straight 1 cuff catheter Straight 2 cuff catheter 2 cuff coil catheter Swan neck catheter Toronto Western catheter Curved tunnel so that exit side faces down External cuff Internal cuff sutured to peritoneum Catheter directed toward pelvis A recently implanted peritoneal dialysis catheter in situ Steps of CAPD exchange with Y set 1. Small volume flush 2. Drain 3. Fill 4. Disconnect